Hello and welcome back to React Native Authentication. This is Lesson 2, Set Up and Configure AWS. In this lesson, we'll sign up for AWS, we'll install AWS Amplify CLI, and we'll configure and set up Amplify. By the end of this lesson, we'll have everything we need to start building our app and adding authentication. All right, let's get started. All right, the first thing we need to do is sign up for an AWS account. They do offer a 12-month free tier access. To sign up for that, visit aws.amazon.com slash free. Go ahead and pause the video. Once you're done signing up, come back and continue to the next step. Okay, the next thing we need to do, let's open our terminal. We're going to be installing AWS Amplify CLI or command line interface. And to do that, simply type the command npm install dash g at aws hyphen amplify slash cli and hit return. All right, so once this is finished running, we're going to run the configure and it's going to walk us through setting up and configuring our amplify. OK, that's done. So let's go ahead and run our configuration. And to do that, we'll simply type amplify configure. What this will do when I hit return, it'll redirect me to AWS to log into my account. All right, so when the console comes up, go ahead and log into your account. Once you're logged in, then you'll go back to your terminal. So it'll prompt you to press enter to continue. So let's go ahead, press enter. The first thing we need to do is choose a region. Okay, now we need to enter a username. I'm just entering the same username I created in the previous lesson, which was HomeWide user. All right, the console should come up. All right, so we have a username that we just entered. We're going to select programmatic access, AWS management console, uh, auto generate password, and then uncheck user must create password and hit next. And then make sure administrator access is selected here. Then for the key value, this is optional. You don't have to input anything here. I'm just going to enter HomeWAD app for my key, but I'll leave the value blank and then hit next. All right, everything looks good. So let's go ahead and create the user. OK, now our user has been created successfully. Go ahead and download the CSV file. This contains your access key ID, your secret access key, and the password for your user. If you don't download this, you won't have access to this after the screen is closed. It'll only show you this one time. But we'll leave the screen open so we can just copy paste these values into our terminal. So let's go back to terminal, press enter to continue. Then we're going to go copy the access key from the console, paste it here. Then we'll copy the secret access key and paste it here. And then the profile name. In my case, I'm going to choose the username, HomeWad user. All right, we are successfully set up with the user in Amplify. All right, and that wraps up this lesson. We are all ready to start building our app in the next lesson.